Hey what's up guys welcome to Fine Gap YouTube channel and in today's video I'm going to show you linear layout in Android Studio. So before start please I request you to subscribe our YouTube channel to stay up to date with latest programming videos. In this video we will learn about the basics of linear layout as well as we will create a basic sign up form using linear layout. Let's start. First of all you have to click on this app folder and click on resource folder click on layout folder and uh, open your activity underscore main dot xml file this is the file that android studio make for us by default when you create a new android studio project uh, here you can see that here is my simple empty screen uh, click on this split button you will see the backend code of your file uh, remove this constraint layout and type here linear layout you can see that the closing tag is aut automatically typed by android studio and uh, guys one more thing you have to give orientation because in linear layout uh, your views are grouped by orientation suppose I type here orientation vertical now when we will add a text view inside our linear layout suppose let me add a text view uh, width would be wrap content height would be wrap content android colon text would be sorry not text color android colon text would be demo text let me close the uh, our tag so guys you can see that this is our first text view and uh, now I'm going to copy this and paste this again and again two times. So you can see that our text views are aligned vertically to one and each other. So suppose I'm going to change this orientation to horizontal. So you can see that our text views are aligned in a horizontal way. So guys, I hope you will must understand that how our linear layout works. Uh, but this was so much basic example. You can also add buttons vertical and horizontal as well but now we will create a simple sign up form uh, so you can betterly understand that how our linear layout works let's start okay guys first of all i am going to remove these text views and uh, i will add a linear layout inside my parent linear layout so here, this is linear layout and uh, width would be wrap content height uh, sorry width height would be uh, wrap content and its width would be match parent close the tag and uh, the width of uh, our parent linear layout would be vertical and the width uh, sorry the orientation of our child linear layout would be would be horizontal and now i will add a edit text width would be wrap content height would be uh 50 dp just uh, close this tag height would be 50 dp and close this tag and just copy this edit text and again paste this below our above edit text as you can see that the two edit texts are created successfully but they are so small because we have not write any text inside our edit text so first of all let me show you you have guys you have to give weight android colon layout weight one and also you have to give this same property to the below uh, below array text guys now you can see that our text views are converted take equal widths to the right side and to the left side so suppose we want to get the first name in the this edit text we will type here uh, android colon text first name and uh, guys you can also type hint in the place of text because we use mostly hint in our sign up forms and guys in the let me zoom out this in the second guys in the second form we will add uh android colon hint uh, last name so guys now you can see that this is our uh, we have created two fields first name and last last name and uh, outside of our child linear layout we will create another edit text its width would be match parent its uh, height would be 50 dp and its uh, hint would be uh, suppose we want to get user email so I, I have typed here email and uh, we will close this edit text and at last we have create a button which would be match parent height would be 50 dp and android colon text would be submit uh, let me zoom out this one so guys you can see that we have created just simple sign up form in our android studio uh, the purpose to create a sign up form so i can show you how you can use linear layout child linear layouts so guys when you will when you will make complex layouts you will use a lot of child linear layouts uh, uh, inside your parent linear layout so guys i hope that you will must, must like this video and if you have any question related to this tutorial you can ask us in the comment section we will try to answer your question and uh, again please subscribe to our youtube channel to stay up to date with latest programming videos and finally thanks for watching